Hey y'all, it's your girl Millie Chun. And what we're about to do now is break down this apology from Tasha K to Unique, who is allegedly Rocky Bivens, Latasha Scott's husband, side chick. And she's brought receipts for five years. Now, as of right now, I don't have the actual video, but Tasha K was interviewing her all day like in the wee hours of the morning she said it was midnight and she hasn't posted it that i know as of yet but as soon as that is posted i'll bring it to you so let's just get into this apology right let's go all right and so we flew all the way into atlanta to do this and um i want to apologize first to the woman that's going to be receiving this uh this this very very detrimental interview but i also want to apologize to the person that i said was lying about uh the things that she put out okay and so do y'all remember do you see her yeah do y'all know who this is hmm this is unique okay Unique, I've been very vocal about Unique and uh, Latasha Scott's husband. Okay. So the reason Tasha K is like clearly using or choosing her words wisely is because this lady right here had come prepared for whatever, right? Because First of all, she apologized to Latasha because of the interview she's just had with Unique, which is Rocky's alleged mistress and baby mama. So she's already apologizing to Latasha and she has to apologize to this lady because if you heard the things that Tasha K has said about this woman, she it's one thing to call someone a liar but the way she called this woman a liar, this lady brought security with her because she said she did not know how this was going down. Let's get going. Hold on. Fake news, okay? Now, I don't know Rocky at all. I've seen his private parts, but I don't know the man, okay? I don't know the man. Now, the what she just came and, and unveiled was five years worth of information. Five years, okay? So, not only am I apologizing to Unique for calling her a liar, okay. saying that it was fake news, um, I'm apologizing to Latasha because this is another woman that's going to be extremely broken from when she sees this, okay? Um, because at the end of the day, it's like, and the things that, like, oh my God, I can't even, I can't even wrap my mind about, around this, okay? So listen, I just wanted to basically let y'all know that we just spent like an hour and a half with Unique, flew into Atlanta to interview her. She gave me her phone. She gave me her phone. Yes, this is two, we just finished this interview five minutes ago, okay? So we started at 12.30, 12.45 a.m. Yeah, something like that. In the morning. I'm doing interviews for y'all. Okay. Now, it's clear that Tasha has learned something from this Cardi B situation, right? She is very apologetic and she is careful. And it is alleged to us, right? But know this. When she posts this video... I am going to be surgical with it. So just be patient with me whenever this comes out. And P.S. Latasha, I would advise you, ma'am, to go and gather up any coin that you can find that you can give your sister. Because this karma right here is a lot. I know you didn't expect this when you got this TV show going because you had time to start a career. But girl. You need to talk to Jesus for real. Put the microphone down and talk to him. Let's keep going. So this is the woman that uh, alleged, it's not alleged anymore, uh, that she was having an affair and was pregnant by Latasha Scott's husband, Rocky.
Rocky Bivens. So this is not a setup. This is not fake. Candy has nothing to do with this. I'm sure Candy is going to laugh about this. But at the end of the day, um, we've seen what happened to Wendy. We've seen what happened to other women in this position. And this shit is about to, um, it's about to get real. Okay? So I'm just going to um, hold it here. But I did want to apologize to you for calling you a lie. I appreciate that. I really okay? I appreciate that. I really do. Okay. I told her she need to stop using them filters. Okay. And um, I think I, I think y'all got to hear the entire story. Okay. Just like I'm, I'm floored. Y'all will be floored. Mind spinning. Dizzy as hell. Okay. So we'll uh, stay tuned. Uh, don't forget. Uh, to yeah. It's the confidence in which she is sitting up here for me. Right? Like, she has a story to tell. And Tamika, like, I don't know what all you did. I mean, $30,000 is a lot of money, allegedly, if this is what happened. But you need to start making some, some installment payments to this girl so you can get this karma off your back. Because this right here, this is devastating. Let's keep going. And of course, um, you guys know uh, where you'll be able to find Unique. So she's a one and done. She's not doing no other interviews. She just wanted to come out and um, confront me. <laughs> she brought security for my ass. Can you believe? She brought security yep. for me. I was like, I don't have no security. So I, listen, I'm I'm gonna be on my best behavior. Well, I didn't I didn't know how this was gonna end. I, I didn't know how this was gonna end. I said, yeah, I need I need security help because you know I didn't know. How yeah, to she was like, I wanted to beat your ass, Tasha. So um, yeah, like so, uh, just stay tuned. All right. So I again, I'm sorry. Let me tell you something. Um. Uh, the amount of times that Tasha apologized to this girl, like, you got to go find it. I couldn't find it. I was going to play a little over here for you, but she, you got to go find it. Um, YouTube, make it make sense. He has something on his page about it. Go over there and listen to it from him. And you'll hear the interview or you'll hear what she had to say about Unique. It was crazy. I'm going to tell you, honestly, I would never want anybody saying anything like that about me. And the way she showed up to see Tasha, I get it. I understand it. After you hear how Tasha talked about Unique, you'll understand why this girl came up there with security. This is, child, this is crazy. Now, I don't know if this is up on Tasha K's page. I don't know yet. But I will look before I go to bed. Um... I'm not going to promise you this is going to be out tonight, but it will definitely be out sometime tomorrow if it's up. Um, Y'all, we can talk about it. Tamika, you need to go get in your checking account, girl, and get this girl her money so this karma can get off your back. And if there's anybody out there who I have offended, I am sorry. <laughs> it's your girl, Millie Child. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.